okay so welcome back so today in this video we will handle our admin routes first of all we will get all the users now all the users can only be accessed by the admin and also admin can get the details of a specific user right so we will handle two routes in this video basically so very simple routes i simply go to the end right here let's type in here admin routes first of all get all users and that will go to slash api slash v1 and then admin slash users so exports dot all users and first of all let's type in here simply uh, cons users equals to await user dot find all the users and then res dot status of 200 dot json with success to true and then the users right and i simply go to simply save it go to the off let's bring in here also authorize roles also this function that is all users and let's router dot route to slash admin slash users and dot get is authenticated user authorized roles that should be admin and then the method that is all users simply save it go back to the postman we know that this user is already admin so he can access the currently of all the users in the database so domain slash api slash v1 slash admin slash users and then click on send now you can see that we got here the users at array and this time we only have one user in the database and you can see that here so simply save this route get all users and that is admin route get all users only for admins so save it all right close this one now if i go back to my vs code and not let's handle that how we can get the specific detail or details of a specific user so i simply type in here get user details that will go to slash api slash v1 slash admin slash user with the id then simply type in here exports dot get user details and i think so this method doesn't exist before no so first of all let's find the user so const user equals to await user dot find by id that i simply pass here request dot params dot id which is this id all right and then we have to also check that if not user then return next new error handler user does not found with id and let's put in here the request dot params dot id and change it to backticks like this and if it exists then have to update the user or oh, sorry send the user so res dot status of 200 success to true then the user i go here so slash admin slash user slash id of that user and that method is get user details 
put here. Also here. All right. So once I go here, I need to have domain slash API slash v1 slash admin slash user. And then the ID of that user, let's put in this one send and you can get the user if I change this 6 to 5 so you does not find that this ID good let's save it get user details that is also admin log get user details by its ID only for admins so save to the users and that's it so we have successfully created two routes for the admin get all the users and get the user details and in my next video I want to handle the routes for example if I want to update the user and also the delete user alright so I will handle all that stuff in my next videos